Do a video on the safety of distance when an engine is running. Absolutely. First and foremost, anybody that works on the airport, especially the ramp, goes through safety training. Pretty much everybody knows to stay away from the big blender. Congestion has occurred in the past, sadly. Stay away from the exhaust as well. Jet blast is not fun. And it can cause damage and injury. One important thing to note is to not be complacent. These engines don't care. They are indiscriminate and they will suck up everything that's in front of them. Head on a swivel and always pay attention. Along with the training, there are placards and markings all over the place, especially on the sides of the engine. The general consensus is about 15 feet away from a running engine at idle. There are different variations because there are different sizes of engine. But rule of thumb is the bigger the engine, the further away you should stand. Along with the placards and markings, you have a swirl that's on the spinner. This also is for the ground crew. You see the airport is a very loud and noisy place. Sometimes we can't even hear an engine running. So that swirl gives us a visual cue that that engine is still active. As for maintenance, we are especially trained to approach the running engine if we need to do a leak check and to get under it, especially in front of something like this, the GE90. Trust me, you don't want to be anywhere near this when it's at full power. On top of that, there are markings on the ground. The red and white line is the barrier or a safety line. Basically, we don't cross it when the aircraft is taxiing up. And as a fun one, they also say the swirls on the spinner deter bird strikes. I don't know about that one. Jury's still out. 